Today we're going to show you how we intend to bring multiple stakeholders together across the service ops within Microsoft Teams, all powered by Helix GPT. We'll be using an example of a homegrown quoting tool going down at the end of the sales quarter. We'll begin with the sales manager who navigates to Helix GPT within Microsoft Teams to report an issue. She bypasses some initial prompt options and tells the virtual agent that there's an issue with the quoting tool. Helix GPT then asks Monica to elaborate a bit while providing some examples like specific problems she's encountering. Monica explains that she made some revisions to a quote about two hours ago, but they seem to have been lost. She also tells Helix GPT she'd like to submit her request so she can track the status, and before leaving Helix GPT asks for her input on who else is being impacted and also how quickly she feels the issue needs to be resolved. Remember, this is the end of the sales quarter, so this is super high priority for her. Helix GPT then asks her to review the collected information before submitting the request. Great! The request has been submitted, and Helix GPT has provided a link to the request where she can see status and review other information if she'd like. Now let's look at how the service desk comes together to get the quoting tool back up and running. Upon learning of the situation in major incident, Helix GPT automatically creates a Teams channel, brings in the appropriate stakeholders, and provides a brief summary of the event as well as recommending the best next steps. Alice, the major incident manager, informs the team that this is a high-priority issue and that they need to act quickly. Understanding that not all parties in the thread can access her system of record, Alice asks Helix GPT to pull in details of the major incident that was created. Alice then asks Helix GPT for more information about the sales quoting tool issues. It's important to note that, as you're watching this, we're trying to serve up relevant UI to benefit the broader group within the Teams channel. Of course, the power users might not have access to all systems, but those with access can click into the record for more detailed information. Helix GPT Situation Observer jumps into the thread with a visualization of the service topology from the operations team's perspective. The team can clearly see what the root cause is, so they're getting somewhere. Let's jump back into the thread. This is when our service desk manager, Alice, then asks Helix GPT the root cause of the situation. The Helix GPT root cause finder agent gets pulled in and alerts the team that the likely root cause is with an issue in the latest release update, recently completed in a change request. Nick must have just seen the notification and is trying to get quickly caught up by asking Helix GPT to summarize where things are at. It turns out it was an update to the currency table that would enable the sales team to quote using the Brazilian real. It is important for service desk teams to have the information they need at their fingertips. In this case, they need to know which developer is responsible for the change request. According to the JIRA records, Sergio is the developer responsible for the currency change. Sergio is immediately added to the chat. He confirms that he did in fact work on the changes. He asks for a little time to look into the incident. Sergio returns with an estimate and alerts the team that he found the issue and begins testing a fix. He's then validated his work and told the team they were good to pick up the latest update. While the rest of the team continues to monitor the situation, Change Manager is creating a change request, while Change Risk Advisor assesses risk and assigns priority. And with just one prompt, Helix GPT updates incident details with remediation. All in real time. Alice then asks the five whys to help her and the team to truly understand the factors that caused this incident. Alice is thrilled with the teamwork. Pretty soon, sales representatives will be back up and running. I hope you enjoyed watching all these different personas come together within the enterprise to solve a problem leveraging Helix GPT in Microsoft Teams.